Welcome back to Google Guru. This video is brought to you by LTech. Hi there. I've got a great question about how to access our print from my iPad using Google Cloud Print. And I want to show you how to do that. Now, if you do a Google search for Cloud Print on your iOS device, it's going to suggest this application right here, Print Central Pro, which is about $10. And it absolutely works great. And it is the recommended app from Google directly. So if you want it to spend that $10, go right ahead and do that. Google also likes to point out that if you have Cloud Print enabled, there is a free option, which is to do it directly from your web browser on your iPad. So for example, if I want to open up this proposal and print it, I would simply open up the proposal, click on the options, go to print, and as you'll see here, it opens up my Cloud Print, and I can actually access the printer that I have access to, and simply hit print. And that will give me access to printing from my device using a web browser. In the case that that is um, not sufficient to what you want to do, for example, if you're in Google Drive and you're in a document and you want to print directly from the application, or perhaps you're using QuickOffice and you'd like to print directly from there too, I found an interesting app called G Cloud Print. Now this is 99 cents, and if you have a Cloud Print device set up, you just set your default printer or you choose a printer if you want uh, from the application. And then from there, you're, it actually enables your iPad to print very easily. Um, so for example, I'll go back to this document, I'll open it up, and when I click on the arrow key up here, it'll say open in, and one of the options is open in G Cloud Print, and from there, I can print directly to my Cloud Print uh, printers. Um, and the same thing works in OpenOffice. If I'm editing a uh, document, um, I'm able to click on the print button and I go print and I'll do select printer and I apologize this is actually it's not going to work from here so what you'll need to do if you're in here and you go select printer it's going to uh, look for your air print uh, printers which is something that iOS uh, manages so what you'll need to do if you edit a document you will need to go back and save it to your drive so if I go back to that specific file um, in drive you'll be able to so here it is again so for I'll show you the full process if I go back to opening quick office it opens it up I make an edit I click here and then I'll just do test then I click close I do save back and then that will allow me to open it in drive and then from here I can open it in uh, G Cloud Print and as you can see I have my default printer set but I can also choose other printers as well by just clicking the little down arrow and I'm able to access what I need to print and then I click print or I can even save uh, it into a queue for later if I'd like to as well. It's a nice way of doing that. Again this is 99 cents and it's called G Cloud Print. It worked pretty well for me and give it a shot but again the easiest way to do it for absolutely free is to jump into your browser go to your document and simply choose the print option and it will if you have cloud print enabled it will take you to your cloud print feature set or again you can go to print central pro on the ios store thank you very much